Yo, what's up, homies? How are we doing this lovely Monday evening? We got an executive order in the talks once again. Coinbase listing some more S coins, seven to be frank about that. We're gonna go over that later in the live stream. Of course, guys, gas prices in real life, they're going sky high, but gas prices on Ethereum, they're coming down a notch. I wonder if there's a correlation between gas prices in real life and gas prices with, like, like with Ethereum. Probably not, but I'm sure somebody has a chart that'll say, oh, well, they, they they correlate here. You know what I mean? All that and more, guys, in tonight's live stream. So let's, of course, smack those likes, smack the subscribe. Let's pull up the BTC price action right here. As we can see, well, guys, I mean, it looks like we're just doing what we've been doing. We topped out here once again, like I mentioned before, not gonna go into too much detail. And uh, yeah, we'll, we'll see if we hold this. We'll see. As of right now, we're still trading down. It looks like we are just trading sideways here. We'll see how, how it plays out. It would be nice to, you know, not fall below this point right here. It'd be nice to hold that. I mean, only time will tell. We'll see what's going on. We do know the Fed meeting's coming up. Of course, probably an increase in rates. We'll see, though. I mean, they, they, it could be another plot twist. Like, plot twist? Yeah, it's not really happening. So, you know, we'll go from there. Okay, now we're out on the tweeters. Awesome. Let's, uh, of course, like, like the fear and greed. Let's refresh this for Becky in the back. Oh, wow, who would have guessed we're in extreme fear territory? And uh, the Wi-Fi is not working for some reason. Actually, I'm plugged in, so, so it's uh, it's wired. Anyways, we're still in extreme fear. There's no, like, we had a red candle. Yeah, it went down. Not really surprising. From 23 to 21, not surprising because you see it in the price action. Well, we had a, a, a bearish engulfing and a nice continuation. Of course, like, we did rally just to stop some stops out today. That's what, you know, like, really happens in the market. You know, have, have like, have to stop some people out. Not, not really surprising there either, 38K. We'll see if we hold this. Um, that's all I have to say about that. But guys, like I said, gas prices on Ethereum, actually they were a lot lower before I went live. They were around 35 to 40 way. Now we see they are 57 at the current time of this live stream. Of course, they're gonna change. I mean, if there's an NFT popping, of course it's gonna go to the moon. Um, gas prices can be ridiculous at times, but it seems like recently things have actually cooled off a little bit. So that is uh, pretty cool in my humble opinion. Um, moving on here, though, just checking out good old Richard Hart. Either you love him or you hate him. Whatever. If you hate him, you probably missed out on Hex. He said Visa, MasterCard, and American Express turned off their services in Russia. Look at look at this one. Visa, MasterCard taking a stand. Visa and MasterCard make big move. Oh, wow. They're really supporting them by making, by suspending all operations in Russia immediately. Yeah, because I'm sure all, all the citizens over in Russia, they're all terrible people, guys. They all just want to nuke Ukraine and get rid of their citizens. Um, if you guys cannot tell the sarcasm right there, um, no, a lot of them are homies, a lot of them are relatives. This does nothing to the government, guys. Of course, you know, Putin, I'm sh pretty sure he's been ready for crypto long before this happened. They are not idiots. They know exactly what they're doing. This is just what the mainstream media wants to say that all oh, good old, you know, Russians are all terrible right now. I mean, I get it, guys. Like, it's not cool that this stuff's happening there. But look at all the genocide across Africa. What about China? What about all other parts of the world that nobody talks about? For some reason, we want to talk about this one for whatever reason. I mean, it's of course, it's a distraction for what? Um, you, you let me know. I have my theories, but yeah, very interesting that they're taking the big stand They're You know, they're take their, what they're going against communism or something. I mean, why didn't we, you know, anyways, uh, we're not going to get into that tonight. It's all about Coinbase stuff and, you know, rainbows and those unicorns. So let me know your thoughts about that. Of course, you know, if you don't like the, like, if you don't like this guy, you probably aren't going to like it. So, uh, Becker, um, pretty interesting. A lot of people do like his, um, his his perspective, even though he says he doesn't really know what's going to go on, but people still believe him because, well, they're just, a lot of people are just idiots. They just like to follow and not take a lead at all in their life. But uh, that's a whole other stream. Continue on here with Becker said, I don't think we are going in a long-term bear market, dot, dot, dot. Everyone is way too bearish. I still think there is a gigantic pump coming this year. Basically goes on to further and say that he's working on his company Hydros right now. He's not really looking at crypto, but he does know that metaverse gaming coins will do very, very well. So we'll see how that plays out, guys. I mean, either you agree with him or you disagree. Hey, it is what it is. You have to make your own opinion, okay? You cannot just blindly follow somebody and they get mad at them when, when something goes wrong. It is what it is. So make your own decisions. But let's uh, let's hit up the chat, see who's here. What's going on, guys? Say hi. Any ninja watchers tonight? Now we got a lot of red bubbles. A few green ones. Waves is obviously taken over. Interesting. What's up, Twitch Radio? How we doing, homie? The T-Bone, Real Transporter, Rodrigo. What's up, Jack Black? Roger. What's up, Angel for Truth? What's up, Sahid? How, how we doing, guys? You guys said you bullish. Oh, yeah. What was going up? That is for sure. Uh, T-Bone says, Becky knows everything. Consult with Becky first. <laughs> yeah, guys. So are you guys buying one of the seven new like altcoins listed on Coinbase? Yes, no. Or I don't know. Let me ask Becky. 
Um, we're going to go over those in a, in a little bit. If you guys uh, are just tuning in, we just got live, so it is what it is. Um, you said they mentioned uh, a billion USDT today. That usually means a pump. Yeah, I mean, like, we'll see. We'll see what, like, what's going on. Only time will tell. The hive mind. <laughs> um, yo, what's up, Young Crypto? How we doing? Yeah, Waves has been doing really good right now. You said you're bullish on groceries. Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, guys, of course, inflation is probably going to get, like, a good continuation of a low food supply. I can see Giant and all the other mainstream uh, stores. They're just, they don't have as much stuff. So not really surprising. But it is what it is. So continuing on here, guys, we have a possible executive order to be signed this week. We've heard this before. So not really getting my hopes up. But since, I mean, if you guys have not watched these two videos right here about Coinbase, you probably want to watch them. They're actually a big deal, in my humble opinion, because um, things are going to change. I think they're going to change fast. And that's exactly what is going to be happening in this executive order. Um, I'm not going to bore you guys with, like, like with this whole, like, like with this whole thing right here. I don't think it's worth reading, um, like it live. If you guys want to go, go re like read it to yourself or your kid, go for it. But basically guys, of course, you know, the puppet is going to be having, is possibly, they're saying he's going to be signing an executive order, but we'll see what happens. Basically it's, it's going to be having all the different branches of the gov in America saying how they classify crypto, see how it could potentially be dangerous for if it gets in the wrong hands, da 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 you know, like this here, the executive order, which has been in the works since last year, will require federal agencies across the government to report later this year what they're doing regarding digital tokens. The plan is expected to begin carving out roles for agencies across the government, from the State Department to the Commerce Department. As basically, they want a piece of the pie when you make money, and they do not want criminals taking advantage of all the juicy stuff in DeFi. They do not want the average Joe getting more than 0.01% on any of their USDT or any kind of stable coin, because that would be a frowned upon, because the legacy system, they can't even give you 1%. And in DeFi, you can easily make a steady 10% if you know what you're doing. So, of course, they're going to come at them. That's what they've been doing. Pretty much shutting down any central authority out there, guys. I am very concerned about se about centralized exchanges. Um, I I'm, I've made these video, like these these videos for a reason. I am very concerned right now. If they're just going to lock down all Russian users, well, they'll find a good reason to lock down all American users. You know, all UK users, all whatever where you live users, even Antarctica and Mars. So I know it kind of sounds silly to say Mars, but guys, it's real. Like this stuff will happen. Um, you see what they've done over the scandemic in, in, in 2020, into 2021, and into 2022. Um, we just continue to lose our rights. So I, I think this actually is going to be bad. Um, and I'm not here to spread fud or like, you know, like get, like get people all in a fearful state of mind. I'm here just to say, yo, this is probably going to happen. So you want to prepare beforehand. If you don't prepare, you're going to be crying. You're going to be whining. Like, why didn't I do this? Or why didn't I know? Why weren't people talking about it? Guys, you want to prepare, like prepare beforehand. Get your, get large sums of crypto off the exchanges, off the exchanges, guys. Um, get, get yourself a hardware wallet, learn how to use it, all that great stuff. But, uh, of course I talked a lot about that in the past two videos. So watch those when you guys have some free time, but of course, though, moving over to the good old, um, the good old Coinbase coins. Let's see. Oh yeah. Yeah. You guys see the A's is on there. Let's see what we got right here. So guys, the first coin that's being listed on Coinbase is, um, this thing called a, a Gergo, however you say that, A E. RGO, however you see that, guys. Of course, it's pumped up a little bit, guys. In my humble opinion, there's no point of buying these things that, like if they pumped up. If you see the daily like this, like why are you buying that? Like if, if you're buying that, um, you should just like say I'm stupid because you should not be doing that. If you're buying this massive pump, you're more likely gonna get dumped on. Yes, could it start ripping right back up? Yes, but your risk first reward is terrible, my humble, like my humble opinion, and you're probably not gonna use a stop loss. And why do I say you're probably not? Because you're buying when it pumped up like, like crazy. But if you, if, you, like, if you do see a pullback and it's not already listed on Coinbase, you can hit it up on Binance, Bitthumb, KuCoin, Gate.io, you know, all those favorite places right there. Currently has a $78 million market cap. So it's on the lower side, but there's a lot of lower ones there on Coinbase. So it is what it is. What like What is this bad boy about? Oh, the blockchain for business, unlock your business potential. Oh, they do a great job of telling you what it is. When you first click on the website, I like when the website has a, a little description there. Um, basically, unlock your business potential, whatever the beat that means. Anyways, moving on. Eyes Network, $72 million market cap, 18% up today. Once again, I would not be buying the rip, um, in my humble opinion, but you do whatever floats your boat. So if, if I didn't already say, $72 million market cap. I believe this is a um, a networking, I, I believe this is a, like a, a YouTube thing, if I'm not mistaken. Um, the hub for an internet interconnected future. 
we have, see like this is like, okay, right here there's just images. You scroll down a little bit and it tells you something. It says um, AIOZ network is a layer one blockchain with full theorem and cosmos interoperability using EVM and, and WASP smart contracts. So basically they're trying to scale other, um, uh, like other chains. Wonderful, great, lovely. Up next is the Thernity chain, or however you say that. You guys correct me down below. It pumped a little bit today, not too crazy. So, sixty-six million dollar market cap. It's on the lower side. Uh, Binance, guys. Most of these coins are on Binance. You know, Swap, KuCoin, Gate.io. Most of them are there. I mean, really don't have to go over like, like each time. Um, but yeah, so it's on the lower side. Not really familiar like what this bad boy is about. Like I said, guys, it ripped a little bit. I wouldn't be buying it if you don't already have it. And, NFT platform, awesome. Of course, NFTs are a big deal, but there's so many projects doing the same thing. So reminds me of the ICO bubble in 2017. Golem, I don't know why they said it listed because it's already on there, but they said it listed, so I'm saying it's listed. But now they officially have the real Golem, not the back in the day Golem. So just keep in mind they have real, the real deal. $470 million mark cap. This is um, decentralized CPU power, if I recall correctly. So that's pretty dope. Um, cool. There's a lot of decentralized storage, decentralized GPU, CPU. Um, decentralized, whatever you want to call it. So awesome, great. Um, it's been around for a while. High Street, yeah, guys. I'm wondering if this thing has to do anything with uh, good old, you know, how about they have some plants there? Who would have guessed? It's called High Street. Um, anyways, it has a 46 million dollar mark cap. It's on the low side. What's this on? Once again, guys, Binance Uniswap, Pancake Swap. So it is it Binance? It is on um, multiple chains here. Cool Ethereum and uh, BSC. Wonderful, um, lovely. So yeah, it, this is actually down. So I mean, one could say might be a great entry. Hey, you like you make your own thoughts on that. It is down at the moment out of all the coins. Uh, but what is this about? The world's high street world. The experience, the high street world. High street bridges the physical and digital world with a brand new, whatever that means, built natively with Unity and blockchain technology. High street provides real products with additional utilities. You know, I've heard the same nonsense over and over again. They just paraphrase everywhere else. I don't, maybe I'm just jaded with reading a bunch of websites, but it seems like a big load of, of you know what, in my humble opinion. So moving on. Uh, status up 6% for the day at about 5 cents. It moved a little bit, but just under $200 million mark cap. Once again, on Binance and all the other good old exchanges you want to buy coins at. Um, you guys, it pumped a little bit. Not too, you know, crazy about the pumpage. I'm not into buying these coins like when they pump. But if it works for you, hey, it works for you. Private secure communication status is a secure messaging app. Crypto wallet and web browser 3 built with a state of art technology. Sounds like a state of art for a hacker to get into. Um, guys, I, I can't be too bullish on these things until I see it. I, I, I want to see this tested. I, I want to see a lot of people on it. And, and you know, because hackers, are, once people get on there, they're going to start hacking. So uh, let's see uh, how that works out in the long term. Of course, I know it may sound a little cynical, but guys, you're here to protect your capital. You're here to make money. So, uh, yeah, you, you, you got to keep it real because if not, you're going to see that the good old juicy gains go down the drain. Up next, though, is Snapsys, or however you say that word. It has an estimated $361 million mark cap. It's not verified by CoinMarkCap. So, hey, you believe it or don't. Um, Uniswap, Gate.io, Trader Joe's, so it's on Avalanche, it's on Pancake Swap, so it's on Binance Smart Chain. Oh, it's on multiple chains. We're, 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 we're um, chain hopping, Arbitrum, Phantom, Polygon. Oh my goodness, Avalanche. I mean, this one just gets all around. Um, interesting. You, you, of course, want to buy the where, like where there's most liquidity. Oh, this is a bridge. Awesome. Okay, so people are using it for a bridge. Well, like, wonderful. I'm sure it'll continue doing well. Uh, or, or like, or not. So, guys, you see, like, this one's down, and so is High Street. If you want to buy some, probably, like, look into those. I would, like, these, like, ones that are pumped, I'd be looking for a pullback if you want to get into it, or just completely just say no, no thank you, find something else, because, you know, Bitcoin, I mean, it's not looking too good, uh, but, it, it, like, it is what it is. Are you guys buying any of these new coins? Let me know down below, um, or did you have some before? Let me know as well. Coinbase seems to be listed, any S coin out there, probably the ones that pay them the most money, so that's just my personal opinion. Uh, let's see, how, how is the chat doing today? We got Eric, he said, homie, can I buy these coins at Walmart? No, I don't know, I mean, maybe your local Walmart has them. I'm not sure about that, man. I don't, they, they stopped selling Pokemon cards, so uh, it's a little disappointing. Let's see. Yes, I definitely agree. Politicians are, de are definitely puppets. Uh, you guys, it's, one, it's just one, like one big game. Yeah, young. Yeah, we just went over that. Uh, Angel for Truth. I'm not sure what you mean by the R word. I don't know what what you're referring to. Yet uh, Tennessee Ecom man. Yes, CBDCs are going to be terrible. I completely agree. I see your point. What's going on, fish? What's up, ginger? Yep. 
Yeah, bro. Well, the thing is, bro, you, um, Jack Black, you have a lot of people that, uh, let's just say, don't follow it correctly. Let's put it that way. They basically later in life, they find it and say, oh, yay. So just so they can feel better about themselves. You have to understand, we live in a society, it's all about feels before reels. When really it should be reels before uh, feels, in my, like in my humble opinion. About to have a weekly death cross, so you're, that's incorrect. That's incorrect. Um, because the death cross is the 50 and the 200, um, we are not about to have a weekly death cross. I will show you. So the 50 is all the way up here at about 45K. The 200 is around 20K. I don't know what you're talking about, man. Um, no, it's not happening. Well, yeah, 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 fish, like the regular, so like, Coinbase always had gold, but they didn't have the real deal. You know, it's like buying, it's like buying the, it's, buy, it's, like, it's like buying a fake, like just a fake Rolex or something like that. Yeah, yeah, fish, they're trying to regulate things. It's not, uh, it's not that great. Yeah, Jack, you said, look, I, I did, it's right there. there, like there's no death cross. The 50 is way higher than the 200. I mean, maybe on a different time frame, maybe. But uh, of course, on the daily, we already had that. I mean, a while ago. The thing is, we're looking for now is the three day like death cross. It's, it's getting closer. If that happens, whoo, we going down. We going down, down a lot. The last time that happened was uh, it was November twenty eighteen, and we dumped like fifty percent afterwards. It was crazy. But hey, we'll see. We'll see if it like if it even happens, or maybe it doesn't happen. You know, who knows? Only time will tell, as we like to say. I know that's not everybody's favorite thing. It is what it is. But guys, I, I, I really do believe what's going on right here with Russia, with Ukraine. It's literally just a distraction. Um, they just want to get control. They just want to get more control over the like the monetary system. They want to release the CBDC, a central bank digital backed currency. They're going to be able to regulate and control your financial life even more. Because when you use cash, you can hide certain things and they don't want that to happen. So just keep that in mind. Uh, it's a very scary times we're heading into. Um, and I, I truly believe you should watch these two videos that I made the past two days. Um, I think they're very informative. I, I think it, it's just showing you what's going to happen. It's not happening right now, but it's li like literally the writing's on the wall. You're being warned. Hey, I hope it's wrong. I hope those videos, I hope what I made was wrong. I really do. I'd love to say I was wrong. But uh, I don't think I'm wrong, though. So it is what it is. Um... Yeah, Ginger, the people in charge. Yeah, well, I mean, it, it, it's all it's all a big game to them. It's all a game. It was a fractal, Chris. Uh, Jack, you said weird. Someone posted a video today. Maybe they use different. Yeah, I've seen people say, "Oh, Death Cross here." Like I've seen YouTubers do that. It's like, uh, with the Death Cross on the one minute chart. <laughs> like, brah, <laughs> the one minute chart. Come on. <laughs> like, who, who, like, who really cares? Uh, it's kind of crazy. Oh, it's a Roger. You said make a, do a documentary, homie. A documentary about what, man? Um, like, like about what? I feel like, you know, to get a lot of views with like with that, you got to have some kind of drama. You got to have some kind of like, you know, big deal. Um, but hey, I mean, if there's a certain part that's interesting, maybe I can make something happen. Yeah, Fish, definitely corruption, incompetence. There's no integrity. There's no justice. Um, there's no justice at all. I mean, it's, it's been like for a while, decades, centuries. But unfortunately, you point these things out, and it's it, it's cynical to talk about. You know, it's not cool to talk about. You know, it's uh, you know, it's it, it, like society labels as negative, but you know, it is what it is. Can you show a shorting on the show? Hey guys, I, I don't publicly post my accounts here on YouTube. I I, I do mention what I buy and sell in uh in the good old patreon so if you guys want to see that hit up the, the crypto enthusiast community uh, for my buys and sell you know what's that like with merch i do have some merch down below in the teespring link i'm still working on some more trying to um, find somebody to make some cool graphics and all that great stuff so if you're you know if you know what you're doing let me know i'm by no means an artist i took art class in college said i drew, drew like a caveman and i'll be real i drew like a caveman because that's just who i am i don't i don't really use that side of the brain um 
you guys can probably tell by my thumbnails, I'm definitely not a professional at that, but it is what it is. But yeah, just hit up, uh, it's called the Crypto Homie Merch down below in the link. Uh, I'll put that there in the, the good old, just comp, like the, like what's that called? I had way too much coffee. The, uh, like the live chat. Like there's mugs there and some stuff, so it is what it is. Uh, like I said, he's, he's using the 20 and the 50. Well, I just want to point out, bro, just to show Death Cross definition. If you go to Investopedia, which I'm, I'm pulling up right now, um, most pe people use the 50 and the 200. So you go, well, that's not even... Well, okay, so this is a different website. I've never been on here, but it does say Death Cross is a chart pattern that appears when stocks short-term moving averages, meaning the average price over a certain time period crosses below its long-term moving average. So in theory, yes, you could use a 20 to 50 if you wanted to, but the thing is, I've never heard of that before. It's weird. Um, there's no fixed rule about what time frame to look at, but many define it, it as crossing over the 50 MA and the 200 MA. Like, and they usually want to look at the daily, but I understand I like to look at different time frames but I still use the same MAs, the 50 and the 200. I'll, I'll just look at, at like a, like at different time frames. Jesus, I, I can't talk tonight. But uh, yeah, I mean, I'm not sure where he's getting that from. I mean, you can even go here on Investopedia. It says the 50 and the 200. So hey, if he likes to use the 20 and, and the 50, hey, so be it. But I'm just saying, that's just weird. So is what it is. Because the issue, though, is then it causes people, because I've seen this before, then it causes people to come, like, to come to my channel and be like, yo, why aren't you talk, talk, talk about the death cross? I'm over here like, what death cross? I don't even know what you're talking about. And it's because they're using some weird, or, or it's a death cross on the minute chart. They'll take the 50 and the 200 on the minute chart. And I'm just like, who cares? It's the minute chart. Cool, cool. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I, like, I can show you the, uh, the 20, because I have that here, the 20 and the 50. And you're talking about on the weekly. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it, it, it's about the cross. Yeah, I mean, he's right. I would not call it a death cross. But yes, the 20 is about to go under the, the 50 on the weekly. Yeah, I mean, it could have just been for views, which I would un like understand. You think, oh, look at the death cross in a minute. Oh my goodness, we're going to dump on... Yeah, like what will fall 100 bucks for Bitcoin? Like, who cares if it falls 100 bucks? It, it, like, it's Bitcoin. Uh... So it's only happened two times in, yeah, well, yeah, I mean, of course, that that's not what, what we want to see. We actually want to be above the 20. Like, guys, in a bull market for, like, for Bitcoin, you want, you want to be above the 20 MA on the weekly, and we are way below it, guys. And, of course, I mean, yeah, look at that. We cross it here. Bam, look at that dump Orinsky with the Rona. Bam, back here. Look at that. Not looking good. Three-day death cross is on its way. Um, it just, it is what it is. Yeah, I mean, like, I mean, the thing, though, like, who, like whoever that is, they, they, they have a good point. It's definitely good. Uh, I just would not call it a death cross. But like I said, to get views, what are you going to call it then? A crossover? The 20 MA cross? Like, no one's going to cl like click on the video. So I, I, I understand why they use death cross because that, that gets the click. It's just part of the game. What's up, Donald? How, how are we doing? You mess around with Chrono Saps? Hey, bro, if you got to mess around, you got to mess around. You guys can always watch it um, after the live on twice the speed if you can handle my voice on twice the speed. It's kind of funny. Yeah, fish. I mean, it's definitely possible for the monkeys at the mother of all head shoulders in the daily. It's a possibility. Um, what, like, what, like, what, like, we'll see. Um, it's going to be interesting to see what happens here. Um, so many people, like Becker said, so many people are very bearish. Um, that makes me a little on the bull side. But I understand the Fed. I mean, if they raise rates, guys, the thing is, oh, I, I just could see them be like, just joking, plot twist. We're going to actually not raise rates because of X, Y, and Z and this new letter they made up because we live in this clown world in 2022 and we just make things up as we go. So we'll see um, how that all plays out. Uh, but hey, guys, you guys just tuning in, consider smacking that subscribe button, smack that like button if you guys have not already. We already talked about the good old you know urgent warning of all the good old crypto uh like the new altcoins on coinbase so scroll back a little bit if you missed that um we're live monday to friday 7 p.m eastern time if you guys want to support the channel hit the patreon down below uh if you guys want to do the good old um trading crypto tax-free you guys can take advantage of an ira uh i have a video on the channel the other day about it um called you know you know, tax-free crypto trading with iTrust Capital. Link's down below to sign up if you guys are interested in that as well. So it's something I, I personally do. So, hey, 
if you're in, I, I think you have, I think you have to be in America for that. But uh, I know at least 50% of the homies out there are, because that's what I see with the data. So cool. Like it is what it is. Actually, I guess right now, what like would be a cool time to say where, like, where are you guys from? I mean, don't put your actual address, but like, like country-wise, you guys are from the USA, you know, UK, you know, Antarctica, Mars, where, like, where, like, wherever you're from. Yo, what's up, the shipster? How are we doing, homie? Oh, I, I know. By the way, you said you're gonna change your name to the Hexter. Um. Hex is looking like a good entry. I mean, it's, it's going down, but, uh, you know what I mean? Buy some, lock it up. A couple of years, see what happens. So it's going to be a bunch of fudge that turns into a nothing burger. Yet. I mean, it's it's possible, bro. I mean, I, I can see biggest plot twist. Biggest plot twist. The thing is, though, it's all hindsight, though. You, you can't really call right now. I mean, you can bet, but uh, you don't really know. We got Donald here from Colorado. I think there's a couple people from Colorado. I think Fish is from there, too. We need a blockchain version of YouTube. Yeah, I mean, there are some, but like the thing is the masses aren't there yet. So you're, you're not gonna get a following there. You're not gonna get people to go there. Um, to have something like the new YouTube, it's gonna, to, to make the masses, they like like their their brains are so small that like to get them to convert, it's gonna be terrible. It's gonna be very hard. And of course, we go, oh, that's so mean, homie. How can you say they have small brains? Well, guys, they do. I mean, we saw what happened with GM. They all fun with that. So it is what it is. Call it the way it is. If you don't, if you don't like it real, I'm sure BitBoy will lie straight to your face. You know, isn't the XRP thing ending like two months ago? They, like they have to raise rates. I mean, hey, it might happen, bro. They're saying they will. I'm like, I'm just saying it'd be funny if it'd be a plot twist. It's not. It's, it's like it's not gonna happen. Hey, from Chicago, trying to go to the moon. <laughs> hey, Chicago. They're known for their their pizza. I was I like I was in Chicago once, and they're all about their pizza. You know, better than New York pizza. It's kind of crazy. I was like, bro, I don't even want your pizza. Best state in the USA. Well, you're in one of the best states, Ginger. Um, I don't know. I feel like Texas is turning into the next, uh, the next California, though, because all Californians are moving there because, well, you know, it's California. You know, I mean, you don't have to say anything about that. But Florida, I mean, they're, they're doing some interesting stuff down there. All, that's all I'm saying. All I'm saying. They're uh, very interesting. I'm liking it. Like, plot twist would be they raise it by more than 0.25 to 0.5. Yeah, I mean, that's another possibility. If they just do, like, a whole, like, a whole, like, 1.0. <laughs> that'd be crazy. Uh, that actually would be a huge, yeah, that would be funny. You know, markets would tank so bad. Uh, yo, what's up, Joshua? How we doing, homie? Blasphemy, yeah. Yeah, no, guys, Florida right now, I, I've seen some funny videos I cannot share on YouTube. Well, because YouTube's not you know, freedom. They're all about censorship and pushing an agenda, you know. <laughs> you haven't noticed that. Well, that's how it works. He said, yes, pizza is good, the deep dish pizza. Yeah, that's what they're all about, the deep dish. I'm not crazy about it, though. It was up, Jack? The dollar was already inflated, was already 99% inflated before the round and money printing. It's put in a lipstick on a pig. Either way, people already work for less than 1% of their value. Yeah, I mean, they're kind of getting wrecked, so... It, it is what it is. Unfortunately, um, the U.S. dollar is losing its global reserve status. Um, it's happening every single day. So uh, you see what's happening with Russia, with China. Let's just say they've been doing things for a while now. So it is what it is. Oh, uh, what's up, Turk One? You said you think right now is the best time to mine crypto to mine it. I mean, if you have if you have the long term perspective, then you should be mining all the time. I mean, if you have the funds, if you, if you have that. You should mine all the time, hold for five years, and yes, you're you're gonna make money. Um, but I mean, if, if you're looking to like game the system, like oh, is right now the best time, bro? I don't know. I'm, I'm just a silly dude on the internet. Like you know what I mean? I have no clue. Oh, uh, the root transporter. What's uh, what's up with Cali, homie? Explain for some oh, oh, like overseas. Basically, how can I say this on YouTube? I can't think of the words that would be appropriate for YouTube. Let's just say, um, in the West here, we have done a great job at making men feminine and making women masculine. Let's just put it that way. That's all I can really say. Do you have truth social? I'm not sure what that is. I'm not sure what truth social is. Dollar strongest in the world. Yeah, well, I don't know. 
I don't know, guys. I think uh, things are going on behind the scenes. Oh, fish, like you like both? New York and Chicago? I actually like a thin crust. <laughs> uh, are they available in Portugal? I have no clue, bro. I have no clue. I'm not in Portugal. It's all available to your local jurisdiction. That's why you're asking me. But you have to see if it's available in your region, man. I, I have no clue. I don't sit down and read all the countries. You know, it's probably not available in, in NK or in... So, like, it's, it's, yeah, I'm sure there's places like it's not available. Um... Was it extreme socialism? Yeah, yeah, they have that. That's yeah, that's part of the issue. Um, and Ginger says I do. Interesting. Um, he said, Jonathan. You said, "What up, homie?" Then blue check marks like, "Govern me harder, daddy." <laughs> yeah, basically. This is sent on Twitter. Yeah. But yeah, Francisco. I would just log into your account, see what's available, because the thing is, it's probably gonna be hard to like search for it unless you log in. Oh, not available. Oh, it is available. And these are the coins we went over it earlier. So scroll back um, if you want to see those. Um, but yeah, so very interesting times. Like I said, there. I'm, I'm trying to look for some uh, some other social media platform that is. Uh, you know, where I, I can, like, I like talking about crypto, but crypto, it gets tied into, it gets tied into politics. It gets tied into other aspects of our life. Like, that's why crypto is created. Um, so on YouTube, it can't really go into it, like, so much. But, uh, um, like, you know, it, uh, you can't really say too much on YouTube because they will shadow ban you. They will hide you away. Um, and I'm not sure if that's what's happening right now or, like, what's going on because, it, like, it might be. But, yeah, I think uh, we need to find something, like, some, like, something else to use. Um, Donna said, everybody has an agenda. Is yours freedom or government control? So, I mean, like, what do you mean by government control? I mean, the government control and the citizens? Because I'm definitely not, not into that. Um, definitely freedom. There's a, like, there's, there is a reason why, um, if you've watched these two videos, I'm pretty sure you can see my point that uh, definitely freedom. Um, yeah, so definitely freedom, like for sure. Unfortunately, CBDCs are going to do the exact opposite of freedom. It's going to take our freedoms away, unfortunately. But uh, there's ways around that as well. So if you ed like, educate yourself and take action. But unfortunately, the masses won't do that because we talked about it earlier. So it is what it is. Yeah, Golem is definitely... Yeah, I would say out of all of them, Golem is probably the one that sticks out the most to me. Yeah, there is some interesting things. I see Lorenzo talking about uh, um, ETH being extremely centralized because the whole MetaMask thing with uh, Venezuela and even like Russia and stuff like that. So interesting. You said Truth Social is the T version of social media. Um... Interesting, wrote a book closest thing to social media. Awesome, okay. Yeah, I thought it was called Getter or whatever, Getter. Uh, so it's not, like, it's not censored. Interesting. So, like, I can sign up, like, right now. It says download. I, I don't want to download an app. I don't like downloading apps. It's like, am I about to get scammed for downloading this app? I just want to use the computer version. <laughs> Call, call me an old man, but I just want to use the, the computer version, you know, like, what's, like, like when you use Instagram on the computer, you have to like open up developer mode so I can make posts and stuff and go to, it's, it's crazy. I'm like, what? Like, anyways, ran over. Yo, what's up, two brain cells? How we doing tonight, homie? But yeah, I'll have to check that out. It looks like I have to use my cellular device for that. A little disappointed. It's only on the App Store right now, so it's only reaching iPhone people. Well, there's a lot of iPhones out there, so it'll probably work out. Um, I did actually sign up and make a community on Locals. I have not set it up yet, but I did get approved. So um, I was thinking I should just start uploading all my videos on there as well in case something happens. Because, guys, I, I don't know. I mean, things are getting weird, and I, I just want to have, like, another... Um, area where all my videos are at, at least the future ones. I think that would be a great idea. So if you guys have a great community name, let me know. I already made the community name, but let me know if you guys have a like a cool one. Well, yeah, I mean, money is, uh, is it controls everything, unfortunately, Jack Black, unfortunately. Cool. The, the opposite. Yeah, I feel like the definition of woke has changed. I just learned like what it means recently. I thought woke meant like you actually saw everything the, the way the world actually works, but apparently that's not the case. It's actually the exact opposite. Um, 
Yeah, I was very surprised. I mean, yeah. Anyways, it is what it is. But you guys, that is what I got for tonight. New Coinbase coins and a few other like minor updates. Gas fees are still pretty low. Earlier, like it's lower than what I first had in the beginning of the stream. Cool, 34 Gwei, awesome. That's nice what's up. So if you want to transact in ETH, probably a good time to do so, like right now. Um, maybe watch to see if it drops. Of course, the NFTs start dropping, you know, I mean, start pumping. Like minting, then they're going to go up. So just keep that in mind. But one last look here, the new coins. Don't be FOMOing, guys. Do not FOMO. It is what it is. Um, like woke means asleep. Yeah, that's like, like the new definition. Yeah, 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 fish. It is, it is what it is. There's definitely a lot of good buys out there, Roger, or just anybody like I see Ginger Blossom ADA, Roger's like in helium. The thing is, though, if Bitcoin continues to dump, obviously that's not going to be good. And of course, I mean, like um, Jack, I think, pointed out that yes, the 20 is going to be crossing the 50 on the weekly. Yeah, that, 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 that that's not good. Um, but hey, we'll see how it plays out. Historically, it's actually terrible. So it is what it is. And we're live Monday to Friday, 7 p.m. Eastern time. You guys will support, support the channel. Hit up the Patreon down below. Smack those likes. Smack the subscribes. All that great stuff. And until next time, you guys know how it goes. May the gains be with you.